Hi guys, just wanted to post a quick video because I've had a few people leave comments on the other XBMC setup videos that they're not able to set up their repositories so that fan arts and things like that are appearing. So uh, just wanted to list a couple of differences from the previous videos that were on the old version of XBMC and how they compare with the new version 10.1. So what you'll need to do to set up your repositories correctly is go to System, go to Add-ons, Go to Get Add-ons, XBMC Org Add-ons, and then for your music, I always use Freebase, so make sure the Freebase is installed. And the same for Artist Information. Then for Movie Information, make sure that IMDB is installed. By default it isn't, it uses a different one, but make sure IMDB is installed because it's by far the best repository online for movie information. For TV information, make sure that the TVDB is installed and enabled. Uh, again, the best online repository with all the fan arts and things like that for TV shows. So once you've done that, go back to the main menu, go to Videos, go to Add Source, Browse, and then navigate to where your media is stored at all my TV shows. and then make sure that TV shows is selected because there's only one entry TV.B it's already enabled I'm going to select run automated scan and then OK do I want to refresh info for all paths? Yes. Now that will go online and it will download all the information for all my TV shows including fan art, including backdrops, uh, thumbnails, information for each episode and it's the best way to get all the information. Uh, there are other databases out there, but by far I've found that the TVDB is the best one. And similarly for, for movies, IMDB is the best one. So I hope that helps, guys. It clears some things up from the old videos and the old way of how to do things. And uh, if you've got any problems, leave me a comment and I'll get back to you. Thanks, guys.